Damn it. It's the D-pad. I'm Rick. And I'm Peter. I'm trying to get a quick way around. It's not working, so we're just going to so gun it's, it. So it's still translucent, so it's still on the countdown to things starting. There we go. Okay, uh, we're in. You can be outside of it when it starts. Oh, okay, cool. You can, can pass in and out. All right. If, uh, you, if you really get stuck in a bad situation, you can run away. Fair enough. Can you, can you can run just... once you're in the, uh, the thing, too? Like, once it starts? Yeah. Yeah, okay. once it starts... An alpha Geo, dude. That's an interesting thing going on there. Is this the same place I was last time? No. Uh, no. Uh, this is the D-pad, though. This is Pokemon Legends Arceus. It is. Uh, I'm also going to get rid of my waypoint because I'm here. I don't need it. <laughs> It'll just forever confuse you while you're yeah. in here. You can get that... Uh, the, I think that's a couple more Apricorns. Maybe it's not. Uh, hard to tell. The Burmy. It's be easy enough Toast to take him. out. Get a flying move going. Uh, Got your ace in the hole. Oh, yes. Uh, Patch of berries. Oh, okay. okay. All right. So, yeah, we got. I, I'm surprised how quickly we're encountering these things. I would have thought it would be a little bit more time before we saw another one. I, I mean, it's been a a week. <laughs> I, I suppose. Or two? Two weeks? Of uh, real time? Of real time, yeah. It's been like two, maybe even three weeks. At least some of these things just get triggered off of... Like actual time? Like the... As days happen. That's fair. It, and if that's the case, we're going to be seeing a lot of these over the course of the game then. Is that Apricorns? That looks like Apricorns. Yeah, yeah right, there sweet. you go. I'll leave it for now because if I want to make heavy balls, then... And that'll be good. I've got a lot of Bidoofs fucking all over the place here. Here in a pasture. Yeah. Uh, we got a noisy ore. we got our Alpha Geodude that I don't think I want to mess with right now. Ooh. Castafern? Sootfoot. Sootfoot. Ah. I, I'm getting increasingly annoyed at, like... How hard it is to climb just yeah. slightly different... Elevations. Yeah, it's like it's not that extreme. Okay, we definitely had a lot of time to get over here. Uh, yeah, it's not that extreme of a of a slope, and she's just like, nope, can't do it. It's like it's okay to use your hands. That's allowed. No one's gonna like tell on you. Yeah, explore. Just like do an outside lap. See if there's anything more that you can grab while you're waiting for the uh, uh, the thing to trigger. Because like I said, you can you can pass through the barrier. Oh, I saw a green thing whip by me there. There's definitely particle effects at the at the edge here. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Some more Pecha Berries? Kind of hard to tell. I, I think, think that is, berries. yeah. All right. It was definitely the same thing on the tree as that other one, and I don't know if it's the graphic they use for just berries. Yeah. I don't really want to aggro the... Uh, the alpha. Right, I've already got Geodude up to 10, so I don't worry about that either. There's a Graveler. Unobtained. Okay. Heavy Ball seems to be the right call here, but he's going to be moving around, so... Uh, smoke Bombs. There nice. we go. Whew. Nice. And a All right. All and right. we're just going to do si do and out of here. Yeah, wow, Jesus Christ. They really give you a long ass time before these get kicking. I thought, I I guess because last time we had such a long ride to get over here, it just had me thinking that, like, oh, we, we really got to like, yeah, hustle. Yeah, we, we uh, what, got stuck on the wrong side of the lake and reset. Yeah. yeah. I could go for some Yanma, too. I know I don't have a ton of those. Yeah, you're only at level four. Yeah. Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. We don't have a ton of time. I can just do this. <laughs> like, <laughs> hey, tall grass. There we go. It is fun to be the threat in the tall grass. Yeah. It's sort of a reversal. Nice little right? change of pace there. Go ahead, turn around. Oh, it's asleep. Nice. What? Oh, I have to stop. I keep doing, like, quick fire on the right trigger. I got to stop doing that. Yeah. Want to turn around? There we go. If oh, you want to do quick fire instead Ooh, of careful boy. aim. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. No, every time the camera goes through. Yeah, that's what triggers it. There's a 
Jesus Christ. I a, thought a splash effect. Yeah, I thought something kind of like thing. happened and I was like, uh. Nope, the camera cut through the bubble. I'm hearing rumbling. I think we're close. I think if you yep. I should probably get to some tall grass here, huh? It has appeared and there's already shards. Those arrive first. Porygon. A staple of space-time distortions, Porygon. Makes sense cuz they would have absolutely no reason to exist otherwise. Yep. Also Eevees. Staple oh, yeah. of the space-time distortion. I know I have at least one Eevee, but like being able to manually evolve them is definitely good. I'm yeah, yeah. I will, and you'll run into a couple of different evolutions yeah. during this as well. Oh, that's the first green shard you've picked up. Mm. Like I said, they're red, green, and blue. Those are items that you see in other games. That's a star Whoa, piece. Whoa, hi, everybody. Oh, and an alpha. A trio of alphas. That's really not good. Oop. Uh. <laughs> Suddenly, the the run of that is uh, Oop. scarier. I, s I said last time in the space to space time distortion that Floatzel was silly. Jesus but Christ! But Alpha Floatzel is scary. Uh. Uh, this is a lot of Luxio and Floatzel yeah. situation. Is that the Alpha? I can't. No, it's not. No. It, Can we it stop despawned. focusing on that one, please? That'd be really cool. Oh boy, I just use that as a distraction to run. Might catch. Oh, stop doing that, game. Come on. <laughs> it's a space-time distortion. It's like the moment I am within eye shot of, of the tall grass, it's like, nah, surprise, bitch. Who sees me right now? Um, I think the float soul that you failed to catch might still be aggro. There we go. Ugh, whoop, little Eevee. Oh. Nice. Don't feel great about my chances there, but... What is that? Ooh, get that. Linking cord. Okay. Yep. <laughs> the, the mystical item that you need to collect to Star evolve piece, hey. the Pokemon that usually need a trade. Ah. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. <laughs> That Porygon is coming for you. Seriously? Ugh. Oh, damn it. All right. He's in. He's he's mad. He wants to fight. That is Ugh. that tracking attack. Okay, let's, get, let's move. Oh, there's another Eevee, or maybe the same one. It's a bush. Oh, uh, Umbreon. Hey. Yeah, it's currently in that tree. Yeah, that's the real problem, is I don't have an easy way of... Ooh, is that one asleep? It might be a sleeping Porygon. Yeah. There we go. You woke That'll it up, do. but Ooh. didn't aggro it. Yep. But that ghost is coming for you. Yep, time to go. Ooh, another Lincoln Cord. Oh, two of them. Oh, shit. Actually, it's the same... Protector, dubious disc. Oh, they're the items. Yeah. It's oh, the, I It's see. the same graphic for all of the items. The trade item items. Yep. <gasps> You can get um, electrolyzers, magmatizers. Damn it, did it again. Ooh, come oh, come on. Fell asleep. Oh, Good enough. Woke up again. But he got the ball. Ah, oh, damn it. Don't think I caught him, though. No. Doesn't look like it. Nope. You would have gotten a, a little push notification yeah. thing. So this is less successful overall, but I'm still not like, why? Whole fan is that literally all three of the evolutions it side is, by side? It is, yeah. That's, that's one of the spawns that happens. That's funny. Uh... Ah, damn it. Uh, let's do myself a favor here. Oh, that's rude. Uh, hi, Yama. Okay, I was like, yeah, that must be, that must mean shit is ending. Yeah. Woof. Okay. I mean, you got a couple of good grabs for yeah. items. Could have gone a lot worse. Definitely some, some serious uh, catch attempts. Yeah. That's some more apricorns, yeah. yeah. Or maybe Pecha. Uh, oh, Pecha berries. I don't think I want to fight another Burmy right now. Ooh, Teddy Ursa. I don't have one yet? Nope. Here we go. Is that an alpha Teddy Ursa? It That's is. adorable. It is adorable and frightening. Yeah, he's going to be... The regular ones are level 28. Yeah. Turn around. 
Oh, and you got a, a, a tubby boy. Oh, it's a heavy one, yeah. All right. The other one is asleep? Nope, just unawares. Huh, it just went from yellow to orange. He was a little Ooh, weirded shit. out by his friend leaving. No, don't run that way. I can't go that way. Yeah, what level are you, anyway? Come on. Come on. Hoop. 44, yeah. Yeah. A little rich for my blood. Definitely a little up there. Yep. Last rain. You gonna take your take your time there, buddy? Yeah, he he dashed the other way, but now he's just having a little saunter back. <laughs> uh <laughs> don't really want to be doing this hanging out next to this guy if it's all the same to you. Getting a little further. Any day now. Oh, it wasn't even a back strike. Not quite, apparently. I don't it know. was a catch. Okay. <laughs> He's curious. Yeah. You know what, though? If he doesn't see me, then fuck it. <laughs> Let's just go. Yeah. I've done what I came here to do, so... That's fair. Uh, and I think... Do I have to turn in my... Or did I already finish that one? The, um... Yeah, I have to I have to report back. Okay, so we're going back to town. Going back to camp. Hooray! Yeah, including and two alpha. caught for the first time. Yeah. So you gotta put your uh, name a graveler. Yeah. And name a Teddy Ursa. And an alpha buddy as well. Alright, how do we do? How do we do? Uh hooray! Yeah. 18 tasks. Okay. On our way. We're getting there. Yep. Uh, return to the village. Hurrah. Cool, cool. I do like the idea of, like, progressive rewards in these games, too. Violet kind of has a modified version of that for, like, the Pokedex. Yeah. And I do like that as, like, having a rolling, like, game-spanning thing that you can get... Like stuff for essentially, mm -hmm. like, I think that's a nice little quiet reward for. Because most Pokemon games, as far as like living decks stuff goes, it's like you just kind of do it. Right. There's no real, real incentive. Like some of the games have had you go completing the Pokedex gets you a certificate in most of these games, like a little, just quick little acknowledgement or like a stamp. Yeah. And like um, in the old games, the seeing professor's all the Pokemon too. sometimes uh, they'll. Will get in some of the games. I think gets you like the shiny charm or oh yes yeah because I think your once you beat the game or sometimes not even when you beat the game but your Pokedex completion will impact how likely shinies are to be found and then if you uh, if you like get all of them then the shiny charm makes it like substantially better I believe anyway I think that's there. how that works there Zeke is promising you that uh, Wanda will get lost everywhere yeah. If I took my eyes off of you, you'd be lost somewhere in the bushes. I didn't even realize she was there. Wow. Hooray! Ooh, Stardust. All right, we can sell some of that. We got some things worth selling. Uh, is there anything in here that's... No. <laughs> it feels silly that it's like, all right, I can use my x-ray vision and psychic abilities to tell if somebody in the building... Nope, right. we're good. Wait, step back in real quick. Are they going to be gone with me? Or is it going to now trigger the next because we've unlocked... The next area, right? Yeah, he should be able to be like, hey, oh, can you... Oh, he's not there yet? Okay. No, nope. It might be because we haven't set foot there yet. Either. Oh, I suppose. It might be after the first time you yeah. go. Which, I mean, we'll be back multiple times in this next thing anyway. Yes. Um, so, let us do a couple things real quick before we close it out. All right. Mostly quick selling of things. Uh, doesn't really matter. We can buy apricorns, but I really shouldn't. Uh, let's see. Yeah, they're very harvestable. Yeah. Star piece. Uh, let's multi-select that. Uh, I for... Are these meant to be sold? I forget. I don't think... Because I, I was keeping them, so... Presumably not. At least I don't want to risk that at the moment. Uh, I don't even remember what else they're good for besides, uh, Oops. selling... Uh, oh, we got a dubious disc. I don't even think I paid attention to that when we grabbed it. Like, we grabbed it, but that's for a, that's a Genesect thing. Yep. It's an interesting one. This one makes Rhyperior. Uh, oh, 
Okay. Yeah, and you'll need, oh, I think, four linking cords. I never noticed the hand icon but behind things that can be thrown. Oh, yeah. That's cute. All right. Uh, did I have anything in here? It doesn't look like it, so I guess for now, anyway, I'm just going to get rid of the star, the star stuff. I guess I'll have to adjust my uh, gamma settings on my TV. It, I mean, it's super, it's super faint. Like, it's easier to see when it's lit up. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, that was just surprising. Uh, sell. Oh, I can't do it unless I'm on an item. Interesting. But if I select that, it doesn't select it to sell that. I sell the rest of the stuff. Yeah. That seems like a mild UI UX oversight. Uh-huh. Uh, so I should have enough for another satchel piece, actually. Nice. I think the next one was below 12k. It might have been 13k. Whir, 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 whir. Hey, buddy. 12k, perfect. Yep. All right, excellent. Next one's 13k, I assume. Or is it 14k? 14k. 14. We've gone up 2k at a time now. Going up by two kilo poke yen. Or kilo poke dollars, which are equivalent to poke yen. Guys, I guess it's poke. It'd be poke yen here, both because it's Japan and because it's long. Uh, actually, no. I was gonna say long before the dollar existed contemporaneously. But it's like no, that's not really true. U.S. dollars existed by the mid 19th century for sure. Uh, yes. Yeah. I don't know exactly at what point they happened, but I'm really reasonably sure that we had those um, by the late 19th. Oh, U.S. dollars was one of the founding fathers things. Was it? Okay. Yeah. Back uh, when Hamilton, it was like silver certificates. Hamilton was all about making sure that we had a central bank. Yes. Yeah. That's, oh, that's a good point. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good. Have uh, you uh, Have you seen I Hamilton? Have I have not. I need to. I need to watch that at some point. Uh, let's see. Put these away. Nothing quite so nice as getting your U.S. history through a musical. Yeah, right. Uh, That's my entire exposure to biblical stories is through oh, uh, uh, movies, animated movies. Oh, for movies. I thought you were going to say for musicals because I'm like, okay, so there's well, and musicals, Joseph and yes. the Amazing Technical Dreamcoat. Th those as Jesus well. Christ Superstar. Animated movies and musicals. Yeah. Uh, is there anything else I don't want to get The gospel right according to uh, Sondheim. Yeah. That's a, nice, that's a nice way of kind of framing it all together, more or less. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think... Like, I have 15 slots open, which isn't terrible. Like, some of these I could probably do with, with putting away, but at the same time, it's like, eh, it's... I don't know. I, I, a bunch of these I could be that could, like could be used in the field, and I'm not like hurting for space. And I think if we go out to the new area and then we start running into that limit, then it's like okay, we'll come back. We'll be a little bit more strict about it. But we're gonna come back next time and we'll head off to the Cobalt Coastlands. See you. Bye. <laughs>